Hey guys, it's Sean, aka the Pumpkin Plum Bob. Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, then welcome to my channel. And welcome to something that I haven't done before on my channel, which really is a long time coming, considering how much custom content I use. This video is going to be a custom content haul, specifically a furniture custom content haul. So I have over 100 individual pieces of custom content, which I'm going to be showing you today in this video. It ranges from bedroom furniture, bathroom furniture, living room, dining room. So pretty much for the whole house. Now these are mostly in sets, um, but you don't have to download the whole set. I will link you to the sets, but within those links for the sets, you will be able to go um, pick out the individual pieces of custom content. If you just see maybe one sofa that you like or a bed that you like and you don't want the whole set, that is an option for you too. But there will 100% be links for all of these pieces of custom content down below in the description. So what I'm gonna do is just jump into an empty room that I've built and just go through the sets with you. If you would like to see more custom content hauls, then make sure to let me know down below in the comments because sometimes when I'm building um, and I put a lot of custom content in those builds, it is kind of hard to go in after and find all the custom content. So if it's something that you enjoy, then I can just save up, you know, however much custom content I get each month, just save all the links as I download it and then just put some haul videos out for you. So do make sure to let me know in the comments. If you are new here as well, then please make sure to subscribe to my channel if you would like to see more of my content. I do builds, let's plays, let's builds as well as speed builds. And if you do enjoy this video, then please make sure to give it a thumbs up and let me know down below in the comments. So without further ado, let's dive into the video. So I do just have an empty room here. Now, I just wanna apologize for any background noises that you might hear during this video. Apparently my neighbours do not understand the concept of social distancing despite the fact that we're in a pandemic and seem to be having a street party. So they are making some noise outside. I'm gonna try and ignore it, I'm putting some music on in my headphones. So the first set that we have is called the Cardoff Venice bedroom set, I think Cardoff is the CC creator. So we have this metal framed bed, uh, we've got a little chair, we have, I think this is, it says a sidewalk, but I think it means like a side table, or they would be cute at the end of your bed as well. A little bedside table, even a little accent table to go up in the wall, not in the wall, by the wall. We also have a little mirror. Now that does seem to be quite low, maybe it's meant to go like right above the table actually, um, although that doesn't really seem to be particularly well placed, unless this is like a bedside table, uh, not a bedside table, a dressing table, I forgot words then, and you could put the chair, mm, doesn't quite work, but I guess that's maybe the idea. Uh, there's some little perfume bottles that fit just on the table there. What's this? A little suitcase, just go on the floor maybe. A rug. And, oh, a little wall lamp. That's cute. So let's go through some of the swatches. Um, so you have pretty much, okay, so there's two kind of like gray, greeny ones and then this pink one. Yeah, it's pretty much green, gray, or pink, I guess, for everything. Oh, the suitcase is a little bit different. It has four swatches, and the mirror does not seem to have any other swatches. The chair has a few different swatches, actually, which is nice because you can kind of mix it up a little bit and how about the rug oh the rug 
it's pretty much oh that one's cute with the little fishies that's a nice rug as well i really like that oh and that one that's beautiful i love that pattern i love plants to be honest so how am i not gonna love that pattern what about the bedside table yeah pink green or gray and then the lamp it's kind of like the the metal on the inside of the lamp that changes color so that is yeah the venice bedroom set from card offer this set and all of the other sets that i'm going to be showing you are from the sims resource i pretty much get all of my custom content there um so i would highly recommend the sims resource if you're looking for sets in particular it's a great place to just go and get sets from and you don't have to spend hours looking for individual pieces of custom content so jumping into the next set this is the xanadu dining room set um we'll start with the dining chairs oh i like that that is a nice chair i love the little cushion on it my mouse it's not playing nice today what do we have next a glass table wow that's very modern oh i like that like marble kind of foot bit at the bottom that's not that's not what i meant but you know what i mean the marble bit at the bottom and the pillars so it seems like there's a few different options for the tables we have a marble table here uh glass table version two oh so there's one without that bit at the bottom and oh a console table oh that's nice and what is this we get some paintings with this let's put this one up on the wall that's pretty cool i love artwork in the sims i i love having prints on my walls in real life so you know having it in the sims is just great some little jugs and cups and little stackable bowls oh i wonder how the stackable bowls work oh can you just oh it nearly it nearly did it there come on don't break my heart all right i'm gonna put my bb move objects on because i'm determined to make these bowls stack okay that is very cute how many do you think we can do oh i don't know why i'm so obsessed with these bowls but i am Oh, we have a rug, if my mouse wants to actually do its job. And, oh, a wall panel. That's exciting. Oh, I like that. What's this one? Wall panel round. Oh, I mean, I know the window's kind of in the way there. That's really cool. Some candles. They can go up on the console table there. Ceiling lights, right? I do have lights in. <gasps> I do have lights in already to just try and give the room some brightness, but how nice is this light? I mean, I don't know if you can really see it because it's very light colored, but I, I'm liking that. Where's it gone? I feel like it's disappeared. It's there. I like the like marble theme to it and oh we have another ceiling light maybe if i put the ceiling lights like not on top of all the other furniture right so that's your two options there for ceiling lights it looks like one kind of hangs down lower than the other so let's check out the swatches start with the chairs oh we have some nice ones is that like what's that on the oh this this cushion is amazing i love it i am also really enjoying the black or black version glass table okay so that just kind of changes <gasps> the black marble i'm kind of obsessed with what about the pure marble table yeah i quite like that that is so modern and sleek and oh look at that color marble I'm enjoying that and I guess yeah it's kind of the same options for the other tables I'm enjoying this set very very much 
Also, this video is basically a reaction video to these pieces of custom content because I just downloaded them and I haven't used them yet. So you're just seeing it at the same time as I am right now. How about this light? This light doesn't seem to have... Oh, it, it's just annoying and won't let you use the tool on it, but it does have different colour options. Oh, that black one. I do enjoy that black one. Okay, I am officially obsessed with this set. I expect to be seeing this in a lot of my builds rugs i'm not a huge fan of this rug to be honest it's a bit for me artwork oh we have some different art that we can put on the walls here some like completely different prints so that's pretty cool and this wall panels come in some different colors that kind of complement the other furniture as well so overall massive fan of the Xanadu dining set. Right, so for the next set, we're just gonna head outside because this is the Regatta outdoor set. So we have a chair, nice wooden chair, also a sofa. Oh, and they kind of like join up as well. So that's nice if you wanted to do kind of modular things there. We've got a small coffee table, a big coffee table. What's this one here? A water lily. Oh, oh my gosh. You could make a little pond with these. That would be so nice in a little pond. What else? Driftwood. Oh, you can make that bigger and make like fire. I don't know why I did that, but you know what I mean? Like a campfire type thing and little love seat pillows. They're nice. What do we have? The awning. Oh, that's so nice. You'll kind of know if you watch my videos that I like awnings. I actually did a video a couple of weeks ago showing you how to build awnings and pergolas and things. Canopy, I guess this goes over, oh my gosh. Look at that, how nice is that? Sometimes I just think like custom content creators are just geniuses. And bottle candle. Oh, does this go? Oh, look at this. This is literally so genius. It, it literally connects to the awning. How perfect is that? So it's quite a small set, but it's just really, really nice. So let's go through some of the swatches. So with the chairs, the wood kind of stays the same. You just get some different seat cushion colors. It's kind of yellow and blue. Um, oh, the little love seat cushions. You get a few different options with the yellow and blue tables. Oh, you get like this terracotta pink color. And I'm guessing the right the pergola doesn't have any other colour options. Oh, and the driftwood you can make darker. And how about the lilies? Oh, they can have yellow or lighter yellow on the inside. And yeah, in terms of colour options, there's not too much you can change with the swatches, but I think that's a really nice little outdoor garden set. Okay, moving back inside, we now have the Valerie dining set. So we're gonna start with the chairs. These are like ultra modern chairs. And next we have a bench. That's nice. This is our dining table. Oh, that's a nice dining table. I enjoy that. Console table. When I put this walls and flooring in, I was thinking that this wallpaper was a little bit busy and might not go with some of the furniture, but so far I think it's been a good match for pretty much everything that I've put in. We've got a plant. Oh, it's a big plant. That's nice. That can go in a corner. Um, some artwork. Oh, it's like a little collection of frames and things. And then we have dinner plates 
It's like a little stack of dinner plates, platters. And what's this? Glasses. If I don't intersect them. Oh, a rug. A little placemat with little plates and oh it's got cutlery on top and oh we have a wall lamp as well let me just pop that there so yeah this is again is a nice dining set it's it's kind of modern and also like the table is modern but it, the wood style is quite industrial as well uh, let's go through the swatches so it's kind of greys, blacks, whites, and the table, oh that black one is nice, and yeah that one with the black runner in the middle. The plates can be white, black, or kind of like a bluish grey, um, same with the glasses. The rug has just mainly like bluey grey options, I like that striped one, that's really versatile, and this bench. Oh, I like the white bench, definitely. What else do we have? The sideboard has matching the swatches for the dining table. The artwork, I love this artwork with the cheese plant leaves and things in it. And what do we have in that? Oh, that one's really nice. And that's nice as well. So some different artworks that all fit different kinds of dining rooms. And lastly, if I zoom right into it, we have the wall lamp. Just kind of basic colors. Again, a really nice dining set that I will definitely be using. Oh, I forgot to do the plant. So the vase kind of stays a similar colour throughout white cream but you can have a pink plant or green plant. The next set that we have is the Pacific Heights bedroom set. So we have a double bed. Uh, I hate when I put my BB Move objects on and then things start intersecting walls. We've got a nice desk chair, um, although it doesn't look like we have a desk is this a desk no this is a nightstand for the right side oh okay so this is like modular so you've got the right side the left side I do quite enjoy these modular beds and beds with attached nightstands we've got some prints for the walls nice Paris print there this oh this is not a print this is a wardrobe I'm guessing. oh this is a mirror I'm very confused how that is a mirror. Oh, I get that now, I I see. It's the woman part is the mirror. Oh, we have some floor tiles. Oh, but it's not like actual flooring. Like I can't shift click and it doesn't replace the other flooring. I guess you can just, this is so confusing. Why wouldn't you just make this a floor? Cause it's kind of annoying. Uh, oh, this is a reflective floor tile. Maybe there's a reason that they couldn't make this a floor, but how cool is that? Look, it's like shiny. <laughs> We've got a little bed runner. And we put that on. Oh, so you can like have that at different points on the bed as well. We've got a pillow with a world map on it. How cute. And the rug. I think I did use this set actually in one of my latest builds because I recognise this rug. We've got a globe lamp, oh I like that it's a lamp, and a dresser. So the dresser we can just put for now just in front of the window. This is a very modern bedroom set. So let's go through the swatches, the bed. Okay, there's only two swatches. Oh, look at that, like dusky pink swatch. And I'm guessing, yeah, the bed stands can go to that as well. And how about the dresser? Yeah, and also the mirror. Oh, the mirror has, <gasps> ah, so it's not just for women. You can have a man there as well. 
and that comes in all of the colour options. We've got the nice chair, the print. Oh, I like the print in the sepia tone. Oh, the globe turns blue as well. But I, to be honest, I don't really think that goes with the rest of the items. The rug has a green option, which I'm not really a fan of, to be honest. I prefer that pinky one. And how about this reflective floors? Oh, oh, the black reflective floor tile is so cool. That's really cool. I'm just going to show you all the different ones. So we've got like a silver one and a kind of orangey one as well. So this is definitely a nice bedroom set. I'm enjoying this. I kind of wish there was a desk though to go with this chair because like it's not really just a comfort chair is it? It is like specifically a desk chair and it just kind of doesn't have anywhere to go. These people outside do be getting on my nerves right now. Next we've got the Soho living room set. Also we have a little ottoman that is so cute. I love that. A chair, a bigger three-seater sofa and a two-seater love seat sofa. Ooh, nice coffee table. I like that. TV stand. We've got a small pillow, a bigger pillow, rug, Soho blanket to go over the sofa. Does it fit? Yeah. And TV. Oh, curved TV. Nice big curved TV. This is a nice living room set. I'm always looking for new sofas and chairs and things. So. It's nice to get some variation. So let's look at the swatches. It's black or gray, seems to be. Uh, the cushions, you can have some like funky patterns. Oh, I like that one that matches the ottoman. And the ottoman comes in that like dotted or checked one. Coffee tables, black and white or all black. I guess the same with the TV stand. And no different swatches for the TV. And again with that um, throw for the sofa, it's kind of the same as the ottoman. And the rug has ooh, some like bright colours in there, but I personally like that black and white one the best. So the next set that we've got is a little bit different. It's called the Erin Decor set. So it's not really furniture as such, it's more just like decorations. So we've got some plant pots, which I will put down. We've got a few different shapes here. Uh, which else of these? Is this a plant pot? That's a vase and that's a basket. Okay, so basically you get these plant pots and then you've got plants that you can like put inside the pots. How cool is that? So you've got a few different plants um, I won't go through all of them, but there is a snake plant in here and snake plants are my favourite. How cool is that? We've got this vine plant, which I think, I don't know where that's meant to go. Oh, okay. I see. I see now. So it goes in the pot like that and kind of like spills out over the side. You've got some vases which I guess you could put like smaller plants in there. Um, maybe you could make this plant smaller with your BB Move object and put it in there. Okay, yeah, that's pretty cool. So yeah, you've got, oh, you've got a couple different size options for the vases. And what else do we have? We've got a poster for the wall. We've got, another cool funky looking vase, throw pillow, what's this one, a little round pillow, that's nice, and a little basket. So this is nice just if you're missing some like little decor pieces, um, plants and things, I always want more plants in my game, then this is a really nice set. So in terms of swatches, I think yeah, we've got black, white, grey and this kind of brownish colour. Um, 
it's pretty similar for all of the pots oh except for this bigger one which has like a really light pink it doesn't have that brownie color um okay so the vases are pretty similar to the other ones i think maybe oh i forgot to put this pot down as well which has like a little rose gold or silver or i guess yellow gold as well trim yeah so that's pretty cool the basket you can have in oh i like that yellow one so we've got a black and white gray and white yellow and white and pink and dark pink and oh we've got some yellow variations for the cushions black and white nice so next up we have a another dining room set a lot of this is just little decor pieces this is the avis dining room set so we've got a bench again there's not the real sort of dining room big furniture dining tables as such just some like end tables I think this is by the same designer as the last dining room decor set, uh, Nineve Design, I think that's what they're called. So we get some more vases and little plants. Oh, how cute is that flower that goes in the pot? A cascading plant in a pot. Another poster. Let's put that and we've got some little things like your kitchen utensils which go on the wall plates chopping boards i have used some of this set before it's kind of hard to show you without actually having dining room furniture down oh, oh this stack as well more stackable furniture so you've got your knife block this though i think pretty sure I downloaded it just for this item and this is a little owl and it doesn't really do anything it's just a decoration but you get this utensil bar which doesn't actually have anything on it it's just kind of a bar that sits on the wall and um, you get an oh it's a towel I thought it was an apron so it's a towel that just sits on the wall a cookie jar a cushion some cutlery which you could put on your dining table and a little candle oh let me not forget the salt and pepper shakers which are essential to my kitchen and the cutting boards are really nice as well they stand up and a little mug as well so in terms of swatches your bench comes in greys, blacks, this kind of peachy colour and also you can change the wooden legs, the colour of that as well and it's the same for the little coffee table. The plants, oh the little flowers have a few different bright coloured swatches. Your vases, it's pretty much the same swatches as the other furniture. How about the owl because this is so cute. Comes in a few different grey black white options and this kind of creamy pinky color and I'm pretty sure yeah most of the other stuff is just some like black and white pattern variations and the poster print has a few different black and white photographs and things on there okay so the final set that I have to show you today is the zero bathroom set I did use some of this in the piggy lock manor renovation video that i put out recently so we're gonna start let's start with the bathtub actually so this is just quite a funky looking shaped bathtub and it goes against the wall and the taps are attached to the wall we then have a toilet which is a floating toilet which to me is just revolutionary i'm obsessed with floating toilets i don't know why also a matching floating sink which is kind of similar shape to the bathtub. We've got some shelves, which are so cool. I really like shelving units, especially in bathrooms. We've got like a mirror cabinet and we've got a sideboard as well. So you could have like your sideboard maybe with your mirror cabinet on top of it. Does the sink, can the sink go in the sideboard? No, unfortunately not. 
There's even a little ottoman. I can maybe like go in the corner or something. And a shower, which I think will attach to the wall and go above the bath. Yeah. You've got some towels that will go. Do they go on the wall? Why aren't they going on the wall? It's a bathtub towel. Oh! So there's basically a little handle on the bathtub and the towel goes over that handle. And then the last thing we have is this wall fixture. So let's see what this... Oh, I don't really understand what it is. I guess it's just like... A... Is it like the toilet roll holder? It just says wall fixture, but I would assume that that's like your toilet roll holder or something. So going through the swatches, your bath and sink and whatnot come in white or with this kind of pinky tone to it. Um, the cabinets are basically black or they're brown and the ottoman is green or brown and I guess that's the same yet for the towels. This big cabinet over here, let me swing over, yeah again it's black or brown, it's like a pinky brown or reddy brown I would guess. And shower, oh so you can have it kind of like chrome and black or the chrome and that pinky tone. Okay so that is all of the pieces of custom content that I have for you in this haul. I'm pretty sure there's like 103 pieces that I've just shown you there. So like I said, if you do like any of these sets, they're all going to be linked down below in the description. And if you just want to download the individual pieces, there will be links on the web pages that I put down below. So yeah, let me know what you think of these pieces of custom content. Are they your style? Are they not your style? What kind of builds would you like to see them in? And if you would like to see more custom content hauls, please, please do let me know down below in the comments, because if it's something that you enjoy, then I will definitely do this more often on my channel. So as always, thank you everybody so much for watching this video. If you enjoy it, then make sure to leave me a big thumbs up. And if you want to see more of my content, make sure to subscribe and hit that bell button so that you're getting notified when I'm posting. Thank you everybody so much for joining me for this video and I will catch you in the next one.